Glad you could make it. I don't know what these raiders are doing here, but listen to what I tell you because I don't say it lightly. There are civilians in there. Some of them are my employees, some of them my friends. Kids, even. But their lives are secondary to securing that Arc Corps. Even your bosses. You understand? No matter what, we can't let the Corps leave that compound. No time to ride the line, so let's go! Don't move. Now drop the core. Don't do it. You will die. I promise. Goddamn raiders. Always do the opposite you tell them. What the hell was that? Who's crazy enough to ambush a lawkeeper's ranch? Raiders. But it's unlike them to be so bold. It's not safe here. I'm taking you to Ara Shandu's place. Hold on, are you talking about Votanis Collective's Ara Shandu? We can't bring them into this. They'll take the core for themselves, no way. No goddamn way. She's no longer with the VC. Besides, you don't have a choice. The core's coming with me. You want to accompany it? Then great. Fine. But my Ark Hunter is meeting us there. I'm not going alone. I trust them more than you anyway. If this Ara Shandu person had previous ties to the Botanist Collective, I suggest we look into her background before we meet her. Let's access the Lawkeeper system again so I can gather more information about her. Interesting. Ara Shandu was once a high-ranking Votan politician. Some form of scandal led to her demotion to Frontier Ambassador of the Bay Area. Although the Votanist government largely ignores Ara's remote position, the locals have learned to rely on her diplomatic skills when dealing with outsiders. I'd say if we can trust an unregistered lawkeeper, then we can trust her too. Bombak and I are almost to Shandu's place. We're waiting for you before your man makes the pitch. Right 
Koopa's in with Arashandu now. Let's see what's going on. I'm sorry to hear about your people, John. It's... awful. Those responsible have X's for eyes now. I'm leaving. Want to make sure the raiders aren't still hanging around. Hey, don't get too close to the ledge with this guy. It's a long fall. We'll be in touch? Please. When I heard about the Stratocarrier tragedy, I had no idea it would crash right through my door. My lawkeeper doesn't trust you, but I'm a bit more idealistic than him. Prettier, too. Thanks. So, what interest does the world's top weapons expert have in possessing Arctic? Is that a rhetorical question? It's the most advanced technology known to man and Votan. And most dangerous- PDS down! In the wrong hands, yes. Are your hands the wrong hands? Depends on your perspective. The Matrix is safer in my possession than yours and the VCs. I don't work for them anymore, Carl. I am simply a liaison for the people of Paradise, and I only want what's best for the Bay. Are you offering to help? My resources are limited. Besides, the land to the south is private property, owned by- Where is Selector? Selector Enterprises. It's a pleasure to meet you. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. Yes, you could have, by waiting outside. Regardless, I'm available to help you find this... What is it called again? Arc Matrix. Yes, Arc Matrix. It's worth quite a bit of script, eh? To those who know what it is. Well, you see, I have a bit of a raider problem uh, that Miss Shondu simply refuses to help me with. It's your property, Varus. You know it's your responsibility, not mine. Regardless, if you take care of these raider rats, I will get... <coughs> Excuse me. I will sell you information that will lead you to the very tech you're looking for. Deal. My employee here will do as you ask in exchange for information leading to the Matrix. Great! I'll be in touch. Varus's hands are the kind of wrong hands I was worried about. What do you think you're doing? Don't worry. I trust that guy about as much as I'd trust a hellbug with a baby. My employee will keep an eye on him. Hands up! Flex you!
world. Oh, I'm gonna go. I'll kill him myself. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go. 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 I'm gonna go.